It's very early, but it is time for yet another spectacular stream with your favorite color surfing DJ, Sergey Svek. Let's go. Hello, hello, humans. Good to see you all once again. It is your favorite color surfing DJ, or rather the Serjavian Shadow, Serena Svek, back with yet another spectacular stream. And whether you're watching live, whether you're watching the VOD, whether you're chatting or lurking, you are all welcome here. And I hope that this stream will bring a little more color to your day. Welcome, welcome, everyone. It is now December 24, Sunday, 2023, at 12.15 a.m. That time check was brought to you by yours truly, yes. And also, yes, we do have a special guest today. It is Serena Svek. That is correct. And uh, we would like to welcome our newest human member, Sinful Dev. Thank you very much, Dev, for joining and becoming a fellow human. Good evening to you. How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome to the show. And yes, um, you are free, Luna, to look res to look at those abs, but respectfully, if you please. <laughs> and um, Luna also mentions, yes, Naman, night streamer, Nasha. Yes, I am a night streamer, but only for the weekends, I suppose. <laughs> I will, whenever I'm going to go ahead and stream on the weekdays, definitely I will still stick to the before lunchtime schedule, just to make sure that you all have someone to listen to while you're having your lunch. Yes, 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 of course. <laughs> hey, Josh, welcome to the stream. How are you? Josh says, hey, yo, DJ, you are hit with the abs. Why not, Diva? <laughs> we, all, we, we all want to, you know, get to those abs, get better health goals. That's what we usually want to get, remember, whenever New Year's resolutions come. And this is definitely not going to be my last stream of the year. Um, I'm, 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 a, I'm a bit bored at home. <laughs> I'll just be staying at home anyway, so I'll just be... Uh, I'll make sure to keep you all company when the time comes, yes. Yes. Alright, and also we do have... We do have... What's this? And Dev is saying, hello, 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 once again, Dev, good to have you here, welcome, welcome to the stream, and thank you again for following. And, uh, let's see here. No, no, Josh, I wasn't hit, uh, hit by that. This is Serena, my female OC, just so you know. So, just making everyone aware, especially if you haven't seen my, uh, Twitter account or any of my previous streams, I did create Serena as a female OC, so that's what that's who she is. She is not female, Sergey. By the way, she is her own character, and once in a while, she does choose to come out just to you know um, say hello and hang out. And also, Dev, thank you also for the lurk. Okay, hope you enjoy the show, and if you need to go ahead and do anything else, feel free to do so. No problem here. It's pretty late here in the evening. It's already... Tonight is already going to be... <coughs> um, we already have... What's this? Um, it's going to be Christmas Eve. Later tonight. It's time for the Noche Buena. Good luck to everybody who is going to be cooking tonight. My gosh. It's going to be a long, long night. <laughs> I know that feeling. Not only for those who are cooking, but for all of those who have to wash the dishes afterwards. Good luck to everyone. Josh says, I re just realized long hair. We got Serena. Sergey is behind the cam camera. No, Sergey is uh, just, you know, going around somewhere, trying to make sure that everything is all good. Yes. So how is everybody doing, by the way? Um, I just spent most of the day just resting at home <laughs> especially after last night's uh, runescape stream we had quite a lot of things happening so uh, we're gonna be doing it again i actually managed to look and i think i found a solution to yesterday's problem because the text was way way too small especially for the 
for the streamers that were watching uh, for the viewers excuse me so having having i think um having that option available would make it a lot easier for everyone so hopefully this will work for all but aside from that i just uh stayed at home and then rested that's pretty much going to be the summary of my Christmas vacation or my holiday vacation, excuse me. I'll just be staying at home and <laughs> sleeping my head off, my gosh. And doing chores because, you know, that's just how we are right now. <clears throat> so we're going to go ahead and continue with the stream right now because it's a bit late and we also have someone coming in very soon so we'll just go ahead and continue from where we left off we finally completed the tutorial yesterday so now we're gonna go ahead and um, continue with our first bunch of quests all right so let's go ahead and get to the world of runescape old school runescape Ah, yes, Panma, hello, good day to you. And of course, Steam decides to crash. <laughs> it was too powerful. The prospect of the prospect of Serena playing RuneScape was way too powerful for for Steam that it decided to crash. Yes. That's just how powerful she is, my goodness. Hey Panma, how are you doing? Panma says, Holy moly, I'm still in ad jail, but I see Serena. Yes. Okay, very, very appropriate reaction. <laughs> oh my gosh. Anyway, good to have you here, Panma. Welcome, welcome. Hope you are doing well. Let's let's just do a take two here, okay? Please, take two. Okay, there we go. Wait, let me just fix the settings here, make sure that it's uh, full screen. So I think, uh, just let me know, just let me know, uh, what's this, if it's a lot clearer now. What And what I mean by that is, is it, are you able to see all the, all the things, all the, you know, all the text. Wait, let me just, let me just uh, fix this one first. Let's make it to full screen. There we go. Now we're talking. Okay, let's do this again. Panma says, Not gonna lie, I was surprised with the animation. I thought it was live 2D at first. Oh, you thought it was live 2D? Well, uh, actually, it's also just a GIF, like Sergey. We're only using GIFs. So, ayon, that's where we're coming from. <laughs> All right, and Mylis did it so well. Yes, Mylis did it very well, actually. Josh also says, Hey, yo, I thought you were holding a tennis racket for a second, and I was about to say, Serena Williams! <laughs> Man, if all, that would be a very interesting thing to have Serena Williams as a streamer. <laughs> but what is even more interesting is that we do have Chili Beans here, who is now another fellow human. Thank you very much for joining the stream, Chili Beans, and for following and becoming a fellow human. That is an excellent Christmas gift for me. <laughs> How are you doing, everybody? Welcome to the show. And let me just let me just go ahead and take care of Luna's redeem over here. Okay, thank you for the redeem, Luna. For those who don't know, we do have various redeems that we could do so you can make me say things in very interesting voices but since serena hold on i dropped something okay so we're gonna go ahead and do ara ara in two ways because it's christmas i will give you a gift i will say it in my usual voice and then i'll try to do my best serena ara ara okay <clears throat> so this is how Sergey would say it because I've been hanging out with him too long. <clears throat> uh, da, da. So that's one. That's the that's my usual voice. 
And then we're going to go ahead and try and bring it up to Serena's level. As best as I can, because my voice is naturally deep. Okay. <clears throat> Uh, 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 uh. Okay, there we go. Uh. Da -da -da. There we go. Are, are, am I not a, a wonderful streamer? I have blessed you with two flavors of Ara Ara. Yes. <laughs> Josh says, we're gonna need 50 packs of MREs for this one. <laughs> Let's go. All right. Yeah, we we don't have any MREs at this time. We're just going to go ahead and uh what's this? Move everything as they usually are. And again, welcome everybody to the world of old school RuneScape. I do see that Luna is excitedly clipping. I know what you're planning to do, which is the uh Luna is um, doing is having like a lifelong mission to try and and collect the ara aras of different streamers. So feel free to go ahead and contribute to the cause, the worthy cause. <laughs> also, uh, audio check before we do anything. I would like to do an audio check. What is the our uh, is the audio okay for me compared to the game? Because I put the music and all the volumes up, so hopefully it should be a lot clearer. And, like I mentioned earlier, it should be a lot easier to see everything that is happening on screen right now. I made the text boxes a lot bigger, so it should make it a lot easier now. Test, test, test. <laughs> test, test, test. Okay, looks like there is no problem so far. Okay, so you could definitely read the text now. That's so much better. Perfect. Okay, the game is a little too loud, Sige. Let me go lower it down a bit. Thank you. We. This is called working together, my friends. The stream and the chat work together as one indomitable team, yes. Okay, so let's go ahead and continue then. We're gonna go ahead and talk to Adventurer John over here. Okay, why am I chopping a tree already? <laughs> I guess I was just so excited, I decided to ask the tree a question. Yes. Look, I want to talk to people, alright? I don't want to- I don't want to chop trees right now, thank you. Hello, DJ Sergey Svek, what can I do for you? Do you have any adventure path starter kits for me? Look at, look at, again, look at, now that you can see it more clearly, look at my eyebrows. Like, hmm, do you have any adventure path starter kits for me? <laughs> Adventurer John gives you a combat path starter kit. Okay. Here are all your starter kits. Okay. And show me some adventure paths. Of course, here you go. All right, Panma says, "Can I just be a chef in this game or something?" Some, from what I understand, yes, you can. You can spend hours in this game just farming, or fishing, or stuff like that. So you don't necessarily have to fight monsters. And even here, see, you do have two paths. You can be like a combat fighting path, for example, or you can be a uh, you can be a gatherer path. So you can actually, you know, just spend time, like what I want to do. L reach level 5 with fishing, <coughs> or wood cutting or mining. So we're gonna go back to, we're gonna go back to the mines today. <laughs> hey Jat, welcome to the stream. Hello po DJ, ay mali si ate Serena pala to. <laughs> yes Jat, welcome to the stream. Thanks for stopping by. How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome. <coughs> How is the art grind so far? Yes. 
Okay, I'm just I'm just gonna go ahead and look for places to fish. So there's a place to fish over there. There are my, my fishing tayo peeps. Oh wait, over there, over there. That looks like a place to fish. We're just gonna take it easy for tonight and start fishing everything. We're gonna be overfishing right now, yes. Just like fishing for compliments, yes. <laughs> Jat says, "Midnight art grinding, Nami. Yes, I've been I've been seeing all of your recent um, art posts, Jat, on Twitter and on my server. By the way, those are really really good art. By the way, I'm very very pleased by your progress. And if you want to go ahead and check out all the art that Jat is making, and uh, what's this? All the Jat, all all the Jat, <laughs> all the art that Jat is posting. And if you want to go ahead and hang out with me as well, um, maybe if I'm gonna play this game off stream, or if I'm going to just, uh, what's this? Uh, or if I'm just gonna go ahead and do stuff offline, feel free to join the Color Surfer Station Discord server. Oh, I don't have a weapon. Oh no. Sergey, Sergey, where's your weapons? <laughs> all the jarts. Yes, all the jart. Wait, give me a sword. Give me a sword and a shield. Okay, now we're talking, baby. Now we're talking. Okay, let's go. On my on my way to fish, I realize that I have to fight. There is no escaping the the path of fighting, my friends. Yes, for those of you who don't know, you can, um, what's this, you can um, actually enter things like exclamation point color, exclamation point, exclamation point food, and exclamation point drink, and you can get um, your fortunes of the day. And also for the Discord server, please make note, or please... Um, understand that it is an 18 plus server, just like the stream. So if you're 18 and lower, sorry, 17 and lower, you are not allowed. Someone is angry with you, Dao, Luna. Well, I guess the only reason why they're angry with you is because they cannot, they cannot beat your awesomeness. So, yeah, don't don't be surprised because of how awesome you are. Sergey is turning from a chef to goblin slayer. Yes. <laughs> oh no. No, no, no. I need to change. I need to change my stuff. Guys, Help! Okay, wait, hold on, hold on. Run back, run back, run back. Get away, get away. Sergey just wanted to go fishing, right? <laughs> Jat says, I also try to... Try to buy some, I uh, know, buy some presents for my siblings, which is what I did last afternoon. Even though nabaliko na lang sa palengke, and I also played from Game Boy Advance Mega Man games last morning before I started my afternoon art grinding. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Hammer, give me them bones. Yes, I like that. Water rune. That's that's a lot of stuff on the on the ground. Take those. Don't mind me. You can all kill all of those things. Let me just take the bones. Dang, give me them bones. Yes. Bony. <laughs> Luna says, Haha, Degen Brain was thinking of something different angry. You know, Luna, just because it's uh just because it's uh Degen hours doesn't mean it always needs to be um it we always need to be Degen, you know? But it's that's true. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, goblin, please go. The thing about the the combat here in this game is that you don't really need to do anything. You just need to stay here and wait for wait for the enemy or you to die first. So that's the that's the secret of the thing.
Okay, give me my sword again. And my shield. And my... What else do we have here? Do I have any weapons? No, I do not. Okay. So much for... So much for peace. So much for peace. We are not... Peace is no longer an option, my friends. The only thing that we can do is... Is kill the goblins. <laughs> I, do, I think Goblin Slayer had another mo had a movie recently, right? I have a sword and the goblin is made way stronger than my sword. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is just so weird. My goodness. Okay, it's just you and me. <laughs> Level up! Okay, who's going to die first? It's you or me? Yes, it's me. That's not going to die first. <laughs> oh my gosh, we have survived, my friends. Give me the coins, pera lang. Give me them. Give me them bones. Give me all the. That sounds very wrong. Okay, but yes, take the bones, Sergey. I mean, Serena, take all the bones. And you know what's something? You know, I actually don't know what what kind of stuff that I could give my family for the Christmas presents. That's the only problem that I have. I don't know what kind of gifts that I can give. So. The only thing that I can, the only thing that I can, I would like to do is just give them money. Direction lang. Just here, I'll give you money. Okay, you figure out what you want to do. Okay, that's uh, that's the best thing that I could provide. <laughs> okay, can't equip the hammer. Okay, so I can't be Thor right now. Fine. Luna says, I'm lurking. Sige, go ahead and lurk, Luna. Hope your back gets better. Lamao, pamasko lang. That's true. I mean, why not, diba? It's it's a lot easier that way. If you want to if you want to make it easier for yourself, just go ahead and give them give them money. Let them choose. Because you know, sometimes Oh, nuts. Three squats, okay. Oh boy, you have to do this, okay. Serena's got the abs already. Now she's got to work another part of her. One. Two. Three. Okay, there we go. You know, it's degen hours, so I just want to say that you know when you were when you were or when I was when I didn't go to the gym before, I was like, that's ah, you know, guys should not be guys should be muscular, yes, but you know, having a big butt is probably not a good idea for a guy. But since I started going to the gym in 2022, I realized that yes, Grow them glutes. <laughs> and also going to the gym made me appreciate, you know, having um, a muscles on everyone. You know, male or female. It's always good to be well-toned. And, you know, just have... Because you can be thin. Or rather, you can be, quote-unquote, not... But you're still... There's such a thing as... What, they, what do they call it again? Skinny fat. Yeah, so your weight is not that much, but you can still have... Uh, you can still be considered obese because of your body fat. So that's just something that I learned is a thing. <laughs> so yeah, grow them muscles. J New Year's resolution, go ahead and exercise, my friends. Get that gym membership! <laughs> Okay, so it should be here. 
You need at least level 20 fishing. Oh no. Okay, grab. I have to I have to get level 20 fishing ba. I'm just a, I'm just a starter. Why? I only have a net. Okay lang yung fishing, wag lang yung cat fishing. <laughs> Cuz that would be bad. That would be very very bad. Okay, don't catfish people. That is very very wrong. Okay, enough fighting. Sergey is in the path to peace now. We'll leave these goblins alone. It's amazing that the goblins just decide, you know what, let's not cross the bridge. <coughs> let's just not cross the bridge. We're just gonna go ahead and start fighting everyone else. For now, I'm gonna go ahead and chop some trees because we need, we need all that wood. Let me go ahead and get my axe. Stab. Where's my sword? What is... Okay, so it has different um, attack bonuses. Gotcha. Okay, so if I got the sword, stab is still a good option. Gotcha. Where's, where's the axe? I'm going to ask the tree a question. Your inventory is too full to hold any more logs. Okay. Alright, well, looks like we need to go ahead and find maybe a store or something. Try to sell stuff. It's very hard to see exactly, like, where where everything is. <laughs> the map isn't very clear exactly, like, where, where things are supposed to be. Like that. But you know what? We're gonna go ahead and just uh, figure it out along the way. And yesterday was all we had. Mm. Oh, okay, so it's out here. It's okay. Let's go down over here. And then we're gonna go ahead and just wander around. I think that's the beauty of the thing, Diva. Right? You get to experience things and just, you know, get lost in it all. Attack woman. <laughs> Why would I want to do that? No. Nothing like good old raiding someone's home. Talk to cooking tutor. Hello. Hello there. Are you interested in learn hearing all about cooking? Yes. How can I train my cooking? <laughs> so how can I train my cooking? The eyebrow, my gosh. The simplest thing to cook here are raw meat or fish. Shrimp can be caught south of here, to the east of Lumbridge Swamp. You could ask the fishing tutor for a net if you have not got one. Alternatively, you could acquire some raw beef or chicken. You can find cows and chickens north of here. Go over the bridge and follow the path north. You can't miss them. Dang. When you have a full inventory of meat or fish, find a range. Look for this icon on the minimap. Gotcha. You could use my range here if you like. Alternatively, you can use your fire, but it's not as effective and the food will burn more frequently. Okay, gotcha. Use your raw food on it. I see. Numerous banks. Okay, and they use dollars. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. What recipes... What kinds of things can I cook? What kind of things can I cook? Many things. You can cook anything from fish to poultry, bake potatoes, or even brew some of the good stuff. What would you like to hear about? Alright, I'm good. Oh wow, brewing fish and meat... Pies and pizzas. Okay, we're good. We're good over here. Thank you. We'll we'll leave. Oh no no. First off, let's go. Let's go to the range over here. Okay, sir. Why why are you going to the cemetery? No, we don't want to go to the cemetery. No, we want to go inside. We want to use the range. Jat says, dang, those early 3D graphics on early PC games, diba? Right? <laughs> That's the funny part, my gosh. 
If you showed this to someone in like 1999 or something, this would have been considered revolutionary. I remember my very first time exper playing, playing like Tekken 1 on the PlayStation. That was something that I... Wow, I, I ate raw shrimp. <laughs> raw shrimp. I, th I wanted to eat the shrimp. Excuse me. I wanted to cook the shrimp, but I ate raw shrimp. My goodness. Cool beans. You are here. Okay, thank you very much for stopping by, and I hope you get well. Thank you very much for your time. So, what was I going to say? Ah, uh, yeah. When I first played Tekken 1 on the PlayStation 1 all those years ago, holy cow, that was considered revolutionary, realistic graphics <laughs> at the time. But nowadays, people would probably not even look at it at all. But despite that fact, it is something that I, I think people just need to understand how... That, you know, you, you get where you are right now thanks to what came before. So, yeah, just, just show some show some credit. <laughs> hey, Flo, welcome to the stream. Let me go ahead and shout you out, too. Along with Cool Beans. Niello, Flo, how are you? What's going on? <laughs> play just chatting i see okay all right yeah it's it's been a while so thank you very much for stopping by flo how are you doing today yellow muslim and flo make sure to ride with the flow okay <laughs> you're dead oh what happened flo why why you dead <laughs> what happened what happened talk to the shopkeeper okay Can I help you at all? Yes, please. What are you selling? <clears throat> okay, so pot, jug, empty jug. Flo says, no pamasco. Oh, no. No pamasco. Well, Flo. Well, Flo, you know what they say? Sometimes it's not the gift. Sometimes it's not the, the, the gift itself, but the person who is giving it. You know what they say. Oh, I don't I don't have any gifts to give you. I am the gift. <laughs> I am so sorry. Actually, I'm not sorry. But anyway, let's see here. Fishing. Where is the fishing? South of Lumbridge Graveyard. Okay. You know, Flo, it was it was really really. I'm not sure if you were if you saw, but it, it's a pity that you were not here earlier when I gave the ara ara, the redeem. My goodness. Okay, so what we're gonna do? Let's just go back to the down here, and then we're gonna go ahead and move over here. <coughs> Flo says, I actually just hope to say hi, I am brain dead. <laughs> well, good to hear that you say that you're, uh, that you still decided to stop by, Flo. Hope you feel a lot better. Less brain dead by later today. Jat says, yep, since I did play on Windows X key as my first experience of playing computer games, but at least I did play Virtual Cop 2 on the PC. And I can see early 3D polygon graphics made in 1997. Yeah, those were very interesting times. <laughs> Hi, well done, Bread. Welcome to the stream. Thank you very much for stopping by. Uh, I am not playing with anyone right now. So I'll just, I just, and I also, this is a new game. So I'm just trying to explore and learn things on my own, if I may. So this is what I'm going to do. Let's go! We got fishing! We got fishing, baby! Okay, hello, fishing tutor. Teach me the basics of fishing. Can you tell me the basics of fishing, please? I see you already have a net. Look for this icon on the minimap to find fishing spots. 
They will move as the fish swim around so you can't be lazy. Ahoy! To fish, you click on the shrimp fishing spot while you're carrying a net. I see. Is that it? There's far more as you progress, not just shrimps. You get more equipment, bigger fish, and other things too. When you have a full inventory, you can cook it or take it to the bank. You can find a bank on the roof of the castle in Lumbridge and a cooking range in the castle kitchen. Okay. And where and what do I fish? Yes. The young and the enthusiastic fisher. Try south of Draenor Village or the pier on the island of Karamja to fish for shrimp at level 1 or sardines at level 5. I, me parrot concurs. What parrot? Me parrot Percy on me shoulder thar. Arr. <laughs> okay, so he suddenly became pirate. Okay. Okay, sure. A parrot on your shoulder. Yeah, there's a there's a parrot. Uh -huh. Yes. Mm-hmm. Go sure. Arr. <laughs> okay, let's go let's go fishing. Let's go shrimping, my friends. Oh right, my equipment. Let me let me fix my equipment here. Let me get my net. <laughs> Jat says, and also played Mega Man X3 on the PC as well. Not 3D though. Not uh, not 3D though. Not emulated the PC port of the game. And this is how and where. I started becoming a fan of Mega Man. I see, I see. So that's what you got. That's that's your story, I see. I actually was introduced to the X series from X5 on the PlayStation. So that's where I was. Look at all the look at how long it's taking me just to get some fit shrimp. And you know what? I I am going to be a bit controversial here. I don't like shrimp. Or at least I don't like shrimp that is not peeled. <laughs> your inventory is full. You can bank your items at a bank. Okay. Where's the bank? Okay, let's go to the bank over here. We need to go ahead and go to the bank. Tara, banco tayo, guys. BPI. <laughs> BDO. We find ways. Yes, indeed. Back through the graveyard and into the bank. Yes. <coughs> Jat says, same. Since I don't want my hand to get greasy from peeling off the skin, which is actually one reason. But the reason why I don't like shrimp is usually because it's also like what happens sometimes with the... Um, if you get like your chicken wings or stuff like that, the problem with shrimp, in my experience when someone cooks it, is that they usually don't even bother that the flavor is all in the shell or, or the skin. So there's no... Ha you know, there's no way for me to tell what the real taste is because it's all just, you know, on the shell. There's nothing else. Is it supposed to be here? Or is it supposed to be upstairs? Okay, let's take the stairs. Climb up the staircase. No, Sergey. Don't go to the wall. Get out. Get out. And then... Go up the up the stairs, okay? Man, the pathing path here is really, really funny. <laughs> okay, up the stairs, Sergey. Now up the stairs. Be a good boy. Up the stairs. Yes, there we go. Where's the where's the bank? More stairs. Okay, so it's up here. <coughs> Up, up, up we go! Climb up. Bingo! This is where we are. Excuse me, deposit lang po! <laughs> I am so glad that I now... I am so glad that now we have... 
um, an option for for online banking in the same way that you know online shopping became super super popular during the pandemic online banking is something that really became popular as a result of that and and i think the best part about it is that i know i don't need to sit in in the bank i don't have to line up outside the bank at 8 30 a.m because banks open at 9 a.m here in the philippines so we don't i don't have to sit at 8 30 a.m outside the bank and then i don't have to wait for like an additional 13 minutes no like an additional hour sometimes just to be able to just to be able to uh um, make a deposit. At least now I just have the bank app and then boop, I'm done. My gosh. <coughs> we are learning about finance, everyone. <laughs> Tabs. Okay. Okay. Deposit one hammer, another hammer, all these bones. We're giving all the bones away, my friends. No more bones. Okay. I want to run another poll here. Okay. We're gonna do... We're gonna rely on democracy. How do you like your fried chicken? With the bones or boneless, a.k.a. tenders? Let's see. I want to know what the chat has to say about this. <clears throat> Ooh, my bread! I got bread! Let's go. <coughs> Let's see, what else have we got? Bucket, Earth Rune, Body Rune. Bronze Dagger? I, I, don't, I don't think we need to keep that. Pickaxe will definitely need that. And uh, I, I think we can just get rid of the magic first. I'm trying not to... I'm trying not to focus so much on magic right now, so we'll just leave that there. There we go. Then we're gonna put this here. My sword is here. The food will go down over here. Yes, we're playing. We're playing Resident Evil Four puzzles, <laughs> inventory puzzles. Because of course we should. Yes. Okay, I think that's good enough. Let's get out of here. Now that you know the basics of using the bank. Would you like to make your bank secure by setting up a bank pin? A bank pin is a four-digit code you will need to use to gain access to your bank once every login. Yes. That means if your account is ever accessed by anyone that is not you, they will not be able. Okay. Hey, Indy. Welcome to the stream. Thanks very much for stopping by. Okay, let me just go ahead and uh, give you a shout out. How are you doing, Indy? Welcome to the stream. Good evening, good evening from the Philippines, and good morning to you. Or good afternoon, if I recall correctly. Okay, uh, let me hide this first, because I don't want anybody to check out my, my stuff. <laughs> Hold on. There we go. That should be it. Okay, so... Bye. Okay, new pin, baby. New pin, let's go. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes. Indy says that's just that's one big jump scare, Sir J. Well, it's true because I want to make sure that um, everybody who is watching knows that Sir J is watching, even if it's Serena's stream. 
Indy says, doing great. It's the evening now since it's going to be 6 p.m. Was playing with Jin and ate dinner. Oh, what did you play? By the way, was it more Phasmophobia? <laughs> oh my gosh. I've seen that. I've seen that quite a lot in Panma's stream. That's very nice to see. I mean, I, I'm actually quite um, impressed by it that all of you like to play Phasmophobia so many times. It's like almost every night it's Phasmophobia and I'm like, dang, I, I, I don't think I could ever, I don't think I could ever handle <laughs> Phasmophobia almost every night. This is coming from me because I don't, I was, I'm also like the type of person who never got, was never happy with, uh, with, uh, Alien Isolation. I played Alien Isolation for like a bit, but I was way too scared, so nope. No more alien isolation. Thank you very much. <laughs> aliens are scary. No, I don't want to go near aliens anymore. <coughs> Indy says, you get used to playing Phasmophobia. I don't get as scared before, but Jin is easily spooked. <laughs> Indy also says, Alien Isolation do scare the GB out of me. You know what? If you don't, if if you really say you're not scared at one any point while playing Alien Isolation, then I don't know if I should believe you or not. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is a totally different experience. Okay, now that we're done with that, let's go back to our fishing area which is just past the graveyard. <laughs> also, we do have that poll. Don't forget everyone in the chat if you would like to participate. Just a little fun poll. How do you like your chicken? Do you like it with the bones or tenders? <clears throat> you know, leave, leave the life of fighting behind. Sergey's just gonna go ahead and do some fishing. Mmm, <clears throat> more shrimp. Let's go get some shrimp, baby. What's going, man? Yes. Indy says, the fishing is near the graveyard. I wonder if there is not a reason for it. That's a very good question. And I, and I hope that we never get the answer to that one. <laughs> Yes, don't mind me. I'm just gonna go ahead and... Yes, fishing level two. <laughs> the power, the power of the fish has grown stronger, my friends. Yes. So it is true, you know. This is, this is gonna be a very, very grindy game. It's gonna be a very, very grindy game. But anyway, we could actually use this just as... Um, a background while we are chatting and stuff like that. But yeah, I'm just happy that, you know, all of you are here <laughs> to do this. Indy says, level two, you can now fish two shrimp. Yes, you can have one shrimp in both hands. <laughs> one shrimp in each hand, goodness gracious. Sometimes, sometimes my English, it does weird things. <laughs> Even though I'm one of those kids in the Philippines that was like, Oh, I was born and raised in the Philippines, but English is my first language. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was just, that was a very, very difficult time in school. Let me tell you that. <clears throat> I don't know, Indy, if there are, if there is a situation similar to that in your part of the world, but yeah, it's not uncommon, especially among the much younger generation nowadays, that they, uh, what's this? That they, that English is something that they are <clears throat> more familiar with compared to, <clears throat> I'm just, uh, compared to the rest, yes. But yes, for anyone in my generation, especially since more more people in my generation are, you know, getting married and having kids of their own. So, yeah, please, please make sure you make sure that your kids, your future kids speak Tagalog and whatever Philippine language you're from. 
it's gonna make things a lot easier for your kids in school. Trust me. Indy says, I remember kids that made fun of those that speak the regional language. Oh, that's also a problem for you guys too, huh? Oh, that's a, that's, so it's an, it's an inter, it's not just, it's an international thing is what I'm trying to, is what I'm trying to say. Oh, wow. So what can we learn from this? Kids will always be kids and kids are not always nice. <laughs> My goodness. Wait lang. Wait lang, I'm just sending a message. Okay, and Indy says, what's this? Kids are evil no matter the country. It was a really grindy game from my memory, which is what they said too. Um, this one, if you compare it to RuneScape 3, old school RuneScape is a really, really grindy game in comparison. So definitely, definitely not something that you should be playing if you want to get like a lot of things happening. I guess you just have to enjoy the show. And I think that's something that we sometimes forget. Just enjoy the show. Yeah. Oh yeah, and yeah, also for Jad. Thank you for that, Jad. Oh yeah, speaking of grinding, recently I was playing Mega Man Zero One. Ooh, okay, I haven't I, I remember that one. On the Game Boy Advance. And dang, it was really needs a lot of grinding to upgrade skills and collectibles to upgrade something to buff up the stats. I remember, you know, it's very funny, Jat, because according to the lore or to the story, uh, Mega Man Zero was supposed to take place right after the events of Mega Man X5. But unfortunately, what happened was is that they released Mega Man X6, then 7, then 8. <laughs> so that really, really muddied up the timeline. And when I first heard of Mega Man Zero, I was like, what is that? <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? I thought we only have Mega Man X. Now there's Mega Man Zero. What is this Capcom? But anyway, it's a, it's a great series on its own. Definitely something else. Indy says, Dev gotta mess up the lore. It's, it's definitely not the plan of the original creator. It was, I think it was like the suits, the management that said, okay, we gotta make more Mega Man X games. And then, okay, well, that's what happened without them knowing from what I remember. You can't carry more fish. Oh no, we can't fish anymore. Oh well, looks like we gotta start cooking. Okay, so let's go ahead and start. Let's go ahead and return to the city. Fishing level three, let's go. Let's go back to the city and start cooking up some fish, yeah? Nothing like going through shrimp. Indy says, how many burn shrimp? No, sh no, Indy. I now know the power of, of, <laughs> of the range. Okay, let's see. Wait, how many shrimp do I have in my inventory? One, two, three, no. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Okay. So here's let's do a poll then, okay? <clears throat> oh yes, for the for the results. <clears throat> it looks like chicken tenders or boneless chicken one. Okay, good job everybody. 
You fin you finally have a response that I agree with. Thanks a lot, pancake lovers. Okay. How many... Alright, no, not a poll. Let's do a prediction. Let's see. Okay. How many... Fish... A shrimp... Will Sergey burn? Okay. And then, let's say... Less... Than... Uh, seven? And then there will be more than seven. Okay, there we go. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Frankie, hey Frankie, thanks for fr thanks for stopping by and for the hydrate redeem. Let me do that. <clears throat> hey everybody, make sure you go ahead and commission Frankie. Amazing streamer, but also an amazing artist. So go ahead and check out Frankie as well. Yes, I drank Frankie. My goodness. I just did. <laughs> so forceful. So demanding. My gosh. <clears throat> Welcome back to Dev. Good to have you here. Okay, let's go ahead and start. Let's go ahead and start cooking then, shall we? How many would you like to cook? Choose a quantity, then click an item to begin. Okay, so let's go cook all that shrimp. Let's see. Looks like we have more people betting more, less than seven will be burned. Okay, let's do this. All the shrimp. Cook the raw shrimp. <laughs> yes, yes. One burnt shrimp. Level 3 cooking, baby! <clears throat> okay, cook some more. Sergey, cook cook the rest. Cook all that shrimp. Two, two burnt shrimp. Three burnt shrimp. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. No, four burnt shrimp. No, no, no. Level 4, okay. <laughs> No, we gotta do this. We gotta do this. Come on. We still we still got four more shrimp left. Five burnt shrimp. Here we go. Here we go. Let's go. Okay. Good job. <laughs> hey, Reeker. Welcome to the stream. How are you? So, who bet? One, two, three, four, five. So, out of 14 shrimp, only four burnt shrimp. Okay. I thank you. Yes. <laughs> Good job, everybody. Good job. So, definitely. <clears throat> I told you. I told you that things have completed. Let's go. <laughs> All right. Let me just uh, fix this one over here. Yes. Sergey is Iron Chef. What up? <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. Sorry. Uh, let's see. See the details. And you should be getting all of your rewards already. So good job, everybody. Good job. Okay, so now we need to throw away all of this shrimp. Because we don't need all this shrimp. <laughs> My gosh. Indy is saying, yay, I'm getting rich. Thank you. Okay, good job, Indy. Thank you for believing in me. If you said, if you said that I was going to uh, burn more than seven shrimp, I would have been so disappointed. Use burnt shrimp. No, if it's a burnt shrimp, you can only use it. If it's a, uh, what's this? If it's a okay shrimp, then it is... Then it is eatable. Eat eatable. <laughs> English, please. Okay, what what's going on, English? Then we have to go all the way back up so I can deposit all of the shrimp upstairs. My goodness. The only thing the only problem that I have with this game so far is that it has you have to click everything and sometimes the pathing is not work the, is not work it's not working god okay english i keep telling i keep telling everyone that 
Um, I, I speak English good. <laughs> but whenever I am on stream, whenever I am on stream, uh, what's this? My, 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 my expertise in English just nosedives. So, I don't know if it's supposed to be like a, a like a big problem, but it just, it just do be like that sometimes. <laughs> okay, I'm here. Just drop all the shrimp. Drop all the shrimp over here. I don't need all the shrimp. <laughs> Indy says, not working, but at least you have the option to use the mouse to move, which is true. I mean, I guess in the long run, moving the mouse is, is a much better option compared to, let's say, um, having to use WASD every single time. <coughs> Although I will still say that I very, very much prefer to use a controller. As much as possible, controllers are my, are my way, preferred way of playing video games. <laughs> We're gonna do another poll. <laughs> what do you prefer to use when playing video games? <clears throat> Controller or mouse and keyboard? If someone, if someone is, <laughs> imagine if someone is playing a game like this. If, imagine if someone is playing a game like this, okay? And then, and what they do is that they they play this game but use a driving, a driving steering wheel. That is gonna be so hilarious. Indy is asking, um, so many cough. Are you well, really well hydrated? Yes, but it's this time of the year, Indy, that I usually have really have coughing problems. It's a. Uh, it's, it's asthma season for good old Sergey, But I would like to say that it's only like seven more days left, but it's only seven more days, but I am going to end the year without using my asthma, asthma steroid medicine, which is a, which is a big miracle, really, which is a big miracle for me. Um, I have I was diagnosed with asthma again in 2018 and every every December January or February my coughing would be really really bad as in I can't even sleep because of the coughing but so now thankfully thankfully we now have that um, option to now it looks like we don't have to use the inhaler at least at this time which is a miracle for me Indy says, Ooh, hope you still keep it close to you in case. Of course I do. Um, even if I don't use like the maintenance inhaler, I will always have the emergency inhaler ready. You know, if you want to make it, if you want to sound like you're one of the cool kids, just say, you know, it's not an inhaler. It's not an inhaler, buddy. It's a medical vape. <laughs> it's a medical vape, gang. It's a medical vape. You know, sound like some of the cool kids. You know, I I don't like smoking, actually, and I don't, and I also don't like vaping. This is me personally, okay? I don't really care if you vape or smoke or whatever. That's your call. But I just say I only hate I hate vaping more, only because, only because sometimes I would smell things like like caramel popcorn or chocolate, and I would be like. <laughs> Hmm, that smells really good. What is that? And then I walk over and I see it's just the smoke from someone's vape. <laughs> I've been lied to. My goodness. Like, dang, okay. All right, thanks a lot for, for lying to me. <laughs> there, I, in my line of work, there are a lot of people that love to do, like, smoking, smoking breaks. Okay? And... Especially for someone like me who doesn't um, really smoke, like who doesn't really smoke, who doesn't smoke, it's uh, it always feels like a battlefield whenever I have to pass by, and and then I would have to go through all the smoke and everything. My gosh, and then and then I would my mind would be bamboozled because I would smell things like grape, <laughs> that accursed grape. 
my goodness. I will never forgive artificial grape flavor ever again. Cranberry grape juice has almost killed me twice on stream because of my MREs. And it's not my fault, okay? It's just cranberry grape. And grape-flavored uh, vape juice is nothing but a lie. <laughs> okay, but to be fair, okay? To be fair, at least to vaping, the it they can be very creative, actually. They can be very creative when it comes to the juice. So I guess that's why they can have, like, entire stores just focusing on the different flavors of juice that you can have. Does anybody here vape? Just out of curiosity, does anyone here vape right now? And if you do vape, let me know. What is your usual flavor of juice? I only smoked a cigarette once. Once. And that was because brother and sister Spec kept telling me, Sergey, you really need to sm you really just need to smoke, okay? And then I told them, okay, if you if if I just like take one puff from your cigarette, will you shut up and tell me not to smoke anymore? They said yes. Okay, so I just took one puff, I choked and I coughed, and then that was it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Never again, thank you. Reeker says, I tried vaping once. I cuffed for a week. So you're telling me, Reeker, you just vaped one time, one instance, and then you cuffed for a week after? Dang, that must have... That's really, really dangerous in, in your case. In my case, I probably would have needed my medical vape. <laughs> oh my gosh. Indy also says, Yeah, I remember being tricked by what I believe to be an apple pie. But it was a co-worker vaping. <laughs> like that's like dang, okay. It was uh like mmm, that's that sound that smells like a very nice apple pie, and then you turn around and then yep, it's just a vape. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um Indy says Imagine wine flavor vape. Well, definitely I will stay away from that because I don't like wine or any kind of alcohol for that matter. I can drink. I drink once in a while, but I very much prefer, I very much prefer um, to just soda and coffee. <laughs> All right, everybody, don't forget we do have another poll. So which do you use to, when you play games, which is controller? Or mouse and keyboard and it looks like we're even right now Con uh, controller and mouse and keyboard are at even can someone break the tie Jat says vape tricks oh yeah the vape tricks I think the only thing vape tricks are for is like like you know making smoke rings and stuff like that which you can also use with cigarettes if I recall <laughs> Indy says, what kind of siblings say that? My siblings, Indy. <laughs> they were the ones that first tried to convince me to drink alcohol. They were also the ones that first convinced me to try to drink, to smoke. So yeah, I don't have the best, <laughs> the best example of siblings. <laughs> Beaker says, technically not one time. I can take the small ones, but the big, big vapes, woo, okay, I see. Oh, welcome to the stream and thank you very much for following Watage Yua. Thank you very much for following. Right on time as I leveled up my fishing skill. Let's go. Looks like looks like we caught another human. And Watage Yua, congratulations. You are now human number 1 780 780. Thank you very much for following me. We need 20 more people to become, to reach 80 by the end of the year. Can we, 800 rather, can we do it? So let's see if we can make another New Year miracle. Yes. <laughs> Watagayua says it was just playing Roblox. Oh, you know, I've seen that. A lot of people play Roblox. 
and, and I think you can do a lot of things with Roblox too. It's not just, you know, I think there was like even horror games, shooting games and stuff like that. Very interesting uh, choices. <coughs> We're back in the mine, baby. Let's go. We're back in the mine. We have a pickaxe because I would like to pick you and ask a question. Yes. And you know what they say? Mining rocks? It's because mining rocks. <laughs> it's much... You know the reason why they use picks when they mine? It's because it's much easier to pick. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is the kind of jokes that you will expect if you choose to follow me. And if you do choose to follow me on stream, if you like what you see and love what you hear, why don't you go ahead and follow me as well in my Discord server and, you know, lose your, lose your mind. <laughs> as I bring up even more dad jokes and talk and, uh, and all those things, yes? Definitely something that you should look forward to, but... This stream, just like my Discord server, is 18 plus. So 17 and below, get out. For your safety. <laughs> and mine too, but definitely for yours. <clears throat> uh, Watage Yua says... Uh, sorry, let's go back to chat. We were talking about smoking earlier. Oh, looks like we have a winner in our poll. So the poll was... Which do you prefer to use when gaming? Controller or mouse and keyboard? And it looks like the winner is mouse and keyboard. Okay, you you PC people. Okay, Sige. All right, you PC. Okay, you know what, rat? Since you decided to attack me, it, it, okay, you you die. Okay. <coughs> rat, rat, rat. Okay. Okay, it's time to die, rat. Stab the rat. Okay, I was trying to talk. Okay, I was trying to talk. Dang it. Okay. Just just give it a little bit of uh I I don't know what to call it. Thunder Raiden 56, thank you also for the very kind comment. You're absolutely cool right now. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate that. This is my first time actually playing RuneScape. I spent like two hours on the tutorial because I was having fun talking to people. <laughs> I'm probably gonna use this game more as, you know, just chatting while I, while I grind. Oh, give me that bread! Eat the bread! Oh, okay, there we go. Woo! Yes! And thank you too for the raid, Thunder Raiden! Appreciate it, appreciate it very much. Thank you very much also for sharing your community. <laughs> Thunder Raiden um, says, Controller is better than mouse and keyboard. Yes, thank you. Thank you for believing in the truth. People are not ready to accept the truth that controller is better than keyboard. Yes. Okay, everybody- Ow, ow! Rat, 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 rat. Out, run. Run, Sergey. No! Oh, hey, everybody. What's going on? <laughs> Dang. I died from rat rabies. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Oh, wow. This is new. So, mortal, you have died, as all mortals do. As you have suffered the loss of some items on this occasion, I have brought you here to explain for you how that works. <laughs> Dang. Okay. I lost items? Oh, no, sorry. The eyebrow is here, so... I lost items? Can I get them back? Let me explain. Across most of the land of Gelenor, when you die, some of the items you're carrying are dropped. A gravestone appears on the ground near where you died. You can go there and retrieve your items by clicking on it. Your gravestone would be marked with an arrow to help you spot it. A grave icon appears on the world map too if your grave is in a mapped area. Gravestones charge a small fee to return specially valuable items, but most things are returned free of charge. Conveniently, a gravestone can take its fee straight from your bank. A gravestone does not last forever. After about 15 minutes, a gravestone will collapse. Anything in it will be sent here to me. I will look after such items without a time limit. 
However, I do charge more for my services. It would be cheaper to retrieve them from the gravestone directly if you can reach it in time. So how do I pay a gravestone fee? I know it. Okay, I think I'm done here. I think I'm done here. I'm afraid we have more topics to cover. <laughs> we really have to listen to this. Okay. Like, dang, okay. Music track unlocked. Rest in peace. Okay. How do I pay my gravestone fee? Cash is always acceptable. Do you accept credit? Do you accept Gcash death? <laughs> grab pay. Because sometimes Gcash is not working. Thanks a lot, Gcash. But grab pay is, you know, grab pay could work, I guess. <laughs> or pay Maya. Oh, sorry, we call it Maya now. All right. Cash is always acceptable. Also, a gravestone can take it directly from your bank in case you didn't have enough with you. Besides that, you can look at my coffer there. You can bring your unwanted possessions and sacrifice them into my coffer. Account their value against any future gravestone fees you charge. Ooh, okay, so we got deposits. Death's coffer won't accept items worth less than 10,000 coins per item. Okay, so I can't just give death raw shrimp, <laughs> is what you're trying to say. I can't, I can't give death raw shrimp, okay. Death doesn't want cheap junk. Dang, Death. Okay. How long do I have to return to my gravestone? A gravestone lasts for at least 15 minutes before it collapses. However, the timer pauses if you become inactive, in case you lost your connection to the world. Okay. It's 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 a good thing at least that the timer pauses if you if you lost your connection to the world. If only if only the timer is inactive. If I lost my connection to you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. Yes. Classic classic Sergey jokes. Yes. All right, let's go. A timer on your heads-up display shows the remaining time before your gravestone will relax. <laughs> Indy says, Oh dear, Sergey, making me hot like that. Ooh, even though it's very hot right now. Even though it's very cold right now. I don't- I think it's a lot better if we can try to warm everybody up. Bring out the fire. <laughs> we cooking tonight, peeps. <laughs> All right, next. How do I know what will happen to my items when I die? There is a menu to predict these things for you. Take a look at your worn items side panel, okay? Okay. The items kept on death menu, uh, so this one, okay. Tells you roughly what your items will do when you next die, including estimating gravestone fees. Okay. <clears throat> I think I'm done here. Very well. Once you pass through my portal, you will have 15 minutes to reach your gravestone. Well, yeah, death is very chill about everything, you know? You know, death is just doing its job. Everybody is just scared of death and demonizing death. So... Yeah, but I think, I think Indy, death does not accept bitcoins. You know, it needs to have actual, actual legal tender. My gosh, and definitely it does not. I don't. I definitely think it does not accept all of those NFTs, which is a good thing. <laughs> Sorry, I like to dunk on those two. Indy earlier said, I need to get used to a controller, and when I use one, I feel like I'm trying to aim with a truck. Imagine having to use a controller when playing this game. My gosh. Jat says, Lamau from Suica Game to RuneScape. Yeah, this is, I think this is going to be my new relaxing game, at least when I'm on PC. On Nintendo Switch, you can always expect me to play uh, Suica Game to relax. But if it's 
but if it's my um if i am playing on pc on steam then probably runescape is what we're gonna do you know just to make the grind a little bit easier <clears throat> yeah indy i understand now i understand why the rats were caged indy says yes those rats don't deserve it where's my gravestone it's right here it says here around here or oh okay there it is there it is okay the one with the arrow. We're heading over there right now. Hey, check my grave. Give me my stuff. Take all. Nice. Your inventory is too full. Okay. Let's see. What can I throw away? Wooden shield. Okay, throw one of the... I can't I can't just toss it. <laughs> oh no, my my starter pack. Okay, throw drop the logs and give me my starter kit. Okay. Now we're going to go back to cooking everything. Okay, hopefully the rats are not going to be there to give me rabies again. My gosh. Jat says, "Grabe kahit patay na." My bayad pa. Yes, Jat. Even when you die, there will always be payments, no matter what. <clears throat> that's why we are. That's why my family is already saving up. <laughs> we already have a plan. We already have a plan. Okay. Before, in, before in my hometown, we already had like some plots left over for, for in the cemetery, but. We're not, instead of going to the cemetery now, what we're going to be doing, since we moved and we are no longer living in my hometown, I'm going, uh, when we pass away, we're going to be in cremated and we're, and our place is going to be near, <laughs> near, <laughs> near Resorts World Manila. <laughs> So we're going to be spending we're going to be spending all of eternity next to Resorts World Manila. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's going to be definitely going to be good for my parents because they love going to Solaire and Resorts World Manila. So, yes. You can now cook herring. Ah, herring. Isn't that the thing that you do with your ears? Herring. <laughs> Dang! Okay. Anyway. Jad says, grabbing fancy. <laughs> well, you know, it's, uh, that's, it just do be like that sometimes. It just do be like that because we had a promo. That was the funny part. We weren't even planning to do that. It's just when we were on our way home from a trip, there was a, there was like a promo coming up, a sale. On plots so like okay let's go ahead and get that and get prepared to <laughs> for our future <laughs> level six cooking let's go look at that everybody out of one two three four five ten shrimp we have only burnt four shrimp let's go <laughs> Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's get over there and, you know, let's deposit all of this. Oh, right, let's go ahead and do a little bit of blacksmithing. Let's just see if there's anything we could do with all of these rocks. The ores. Indy says, I'm picturing the rat chasing you until the end of the game. <laughs> and, the, and the rat is leveling up with you. You know what? I think that's a, I think that's a good idea. Let's go, after we try smithing something with this, let's go back and fight that rat. <laughs> that rat and I have some unfinished business together. I'm not going to end the stream until we, until we, uh, what's this? Until I find that rat. <laughs>
Copper and tin. Okay. A bar of bronze. Okay. All. Give me more. Give me another bronze bar. Another bar of bronze. Let's go. Okay. Now what do we do? <laughs> I forgot where the forge is. Ah, there we go. Imano. Attack the giant rat. We're doing zero damage to each other. Oh my gosh. Okay. Look at that. My my character isn't even like attacking. My gosh. It's just... <clears throat> there we go. <clears throat> Is the stream bugging on your side? Okay, hold on. I don't see any drop frames right now. It should be okay. Hopefully. It's okay now? Okay, good. Thank you. Okay, rat. Come on. It's just you and me. It's just you and me. And all of the people. And now the rat's gonna die. Because it killed me. It was the ads that made it bug. Oh, okay. I understand. Come on. Okay. You think you're gonna go kill me, rat? We have much, much more. <laughs> four. Okay, we have four more hit points. Let's go. We can do this. We can do this. Come on. Come on, rat. <laughs> Indy says Master Splinter asked for it. <laughs> Dang. Okay, come on, rat. Come on, rat. It's We're gonna be here all night if we need to. <laughs> Yes, yes. Okay, eat, eat, Sergey, eat. Yes. Nom, 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 nom. Eat that shrimp. Nom, 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 nom. No time to take the shell out, Sergey. Just eat, eat. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, come on, rat. Come on, die, rat. Die. <laughs> Please. Please, just... There we go. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Revenge! The rat is finally dead. Thank gosh. And everyone celebrated. <sighs> okay, there we go. Okay, let's, let's, let's go home. Okay. Oh, wait. Raw rat meat. Raw rat meat. Okay. Give me that rat meat. Yes. Give me the bones as well. Mm. Okay, let's go. Let's go then. Dang, the rat is rich. Yes. Imagine that. I still find it funny whenever there are like RPGs and other games. And then you're fighting like a rat, for example. And somehow the rat... The rat is able is somehow able to contain like a sword or or coins inside its belly for some reason. <laughs> How is that even possible? Okay, let's go let's go find the seller. And we're gonna go ahead and instead of like depositing all our stuff, let's just go ahead and sell stuff so we can make more coins. <laughs> Let's see, over here. I'm going to be rich! Yes, we're going to be rich by selling some stuff, yes. Woodsman Shooter, okay. Mm. Indy, Indy says, um, Indy says, the rat wasn't, the coins wasn't in his belly. The rat was carrying the money for his son's university. Well, the rat should have thought about that before it decided to attack me. My gosh. You know you could have thought about that. Think about your son's future and the and the insurance, man. Okay. Can I help you at all? 
Yes, please. What are you selling? Right click on inventory to sell item. Okay, I'm selling my burnt shrimp. Okay, sell this burnt shrimp too, and this burnt shrimp, and this burnt shrimp, and then my bones. <laughs> Take them bones. Take them bones. Okay. What did I get? Can I help you at all? Yes. Okay, so I sold this. Do I, do I get any money though? That's the problem. I, I don't know if I got any money as a result. Oh, 10 coins. Right? Wait, hold on. I think I got something. I think I, I think I don't understand something. Let's go back. There's a goblin right outside your door, Mr. Shopkeeper. Mm. You already had 10 coins before. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, gotcha. Right click on inventory to sell item. Okay. Maybe silver coins? I didn't check. I don't know. I don't have any uh, coins as far as I'm aware. Burnt shrimp on only costs one coin. <laughs> okay, well, we sold it at least, so... Ion. Right-click on shop to buy item. Let's just- let's just experiment, okay? Sell one shrimp. Okay, two coins. There we go, so we did sell it. We did sell it properly. Okay, good. I guess, you know, people just don't- people just don't appreciate the power of the burnt shrimp, I guess. Okay, let's- let's go back to the bank and pick up some of our items that we got before, and then we'll go ahead and try to sell stuff. All oh, right, the- the anv- oh yeah, we need to get my hammer from the bank. I can't forge anything without my hammer, so let's go upstairs. Back to the castle. Indy says, make a fortune with burnt shrimp. <laughs> Making an empire out of burnt shrimp. Yes, that is what we need to do. Indeed. <laughs> we'll burn down the city. No, we'll burn down the shrimp. That's, that's the goal. <laughs> and then we will get rich, my friends. Rich, rich, rich. Okay, and climb up the staircase again. All right, and then we'll go to our bank. Hey everybody, I would like to make a withdrawal. <laughs> Getting all my burnt shrimp back, baby. Okay, I would like to withdraw all the burnt shrimp and all my good shrimp, yes. Oh, okay, sorry. Uh, get rid of this air rune. Deposit that. Oh, sorry. Deposit all the air runes. We're, we're not going for magic in this run. We're going for all, all monkey mode strength. <laughs> and then we withdraw the hammer, yes. Drag stacks of items to this incinerator to destroy them. Oh. Oh, so that's what you can do. Okay. Well, we'll leave it that first. And then we'll go downstairs again. Okay, let's go down, 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 down. And one more floor. I remember... I remember when I was in university, there were some times when um, classes would be held on the third floor and they had no stairs. Excuse me, they had stairs. <laughs> Excuse me. Of course it would have stairs, but the problem is they had no elevators. And the problem was there were like a couple of students that had to use wheelchairs. And since there were no elevators, 
they had to rely on, let's say, they had to rely on someone else carrying them up the stairs and down the stairs in order to actually, you know, get to their classes. That's, that's a problem that I still see these days when it comes to, like, for people with disabilities. You know, they really need to have, like, better ways of accessing floors. Because at least in my university, uh, they, the only time you're allowed to have an elevator there is if you are... What's this? An elevator is only allowed if there were, like, four or five floors. <laughs> I mean... Sure, taking the stairs is a lot healthier, but you know, sometimes having the option is always infinitely better, I think. Coffee Jelly says, redeem. Yes, okay, let's go ahead and do that then. But first, let me go ahead and, um, let me go ahead and uh, give you a shout out. Let's go ahead and hydrate then. Hold on. How is Valo? Coffee Jelly? Yes. And... <clears throat> okay, let's go ahead and stretch. <clears throat> oh. oh, I felt that crack. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, my legs still hurt. My goodness, my legs hurt. We're hurting from all the all the stationary biking I did earlier. Ah, oh. ah, oh, yeah. Coffee Jelly says, "I hate myself for playing this game." <laughs> Some will I will I hate in this <laughs> Coffee Jelly. <laughs> You can tell me, you can be honest with me. When I'm having fun, you know, the, the, the goal for me is just to use this as like background while I'm, while I'm chatting. So I think that's a, a reasonable thing because this thing is really, really grindy. <laughs> okay, shopkeeper, give me your stuff. I mean, let me, let me go sell you my shrimp. <laughs> Sell the shrimp. Sell this burnt shrimp. This other burnt shrimp. Yes, and the other burnt shrimp. Okay, now we're gonna sell... How many shrimp? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, let's sell five shrimp. Money, baby! <laughs> Indy says that moans. Oh no, Indy. No, this... It's Degen hours, but, you know, we still have to be very careful under the Twitch TOS. Unless. <laughs> Give me this map. <clears throat> Jat says, investment tips, sell shrimp. Yes. <laughs> you have to sell that shrimp, you know. Sell the shrimp. That's, that's the how we're going to be fixing this problem. We're, Sergey, Sergey, and Serena are gonna be making a fortune selling burned shrimp. <laughs> that is the basis for their wealth. My goodness. Okay, let's see. Two bars. So we have two bars. Long sword. Wait, what do I have in my worn equipment? Bronze sword. Okay. Smithing level of four to create a bronze sword. Okay. What is my smithing level, though? Okay, let's go take a look at this one. My fishing level is... It should be level five now, right? Mining, wood cutting. Okay. That's very strange. I thought we were already on that path. Unless I thought wrong. <clears throat> yeah, there's a lot of things I'm still getting used to because this is my first time playing. So... Ion. There we go. Focus on the gatherer path. We need to get that shrimp. We need to get that shrimp. We need to start 
Um, building up our options, my friends. Yes. Axe. Okay. Smith a bronze axe. Okay. Okay, so it looks like we got more axes. Okay. Time to go ahead and start axing people quest the right questions. Yes. <laughs> I am so sorry. Actually, I'm not sorry, but yes. So, slashy slashy with the axe Gotcha. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and test this out on... on some goblins, I guess. Indy says... Indy says... Why not try forging a shrimp axe? <laughs> A shrimp axe would be something really, really funny. Reeker says, gonna sleep, gonna sleep now. Good luck on the shrimp in business. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes. Indy says, as long as I'm not one of the... Good, good night, by the way, Reeker. Thanks for your time. And yes, I just want to say that, yes, definitely, definitely, Indy, you are not one of the... Definitely not one of the goblins. Rest assured. You are definitely not one of the goblins. I have I have something better in mind for you. Yes. Come on. Ask the goblin a question. You can do it. Yes. 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 Okay, attack it. Attack it. The goblin, the goblin's health went up. The goblin is healing. <laughs> Why? <laughs> no, do not heal. Okay, no. No. Dang it. Why am I doing zero damage? Dang it. Die. 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 Oh, thank God. Attack level 3. Let's go, baby. Combat level is 4. Nice. Give me them bones. Give me the coins. Nice. Okay, time to time to eat my shrimp. <laughs> the goblin is probably screaming, Leave me alone! No. All goblins need to go. Except for Indy. Indy, Indy you can stay. You're fine. Indy, Indy is a good, good person. We don't need to worry about the other goblins. Yes. You know there are guards here just watching. They're not even doing anything while someone is attacking a goblin like two inches from their face. <laughs> My gosh. Jat says, "Lamau, you invest shrimp. You consume shrimp." All life begins and ends with shrimp. That is the only way. That is the truth. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Looks like we got something here. Bronze square shield. Okay. Well, that's that's pretty cool. Wield bronze square shield. Nice, nice. Okay. Attack one of the goblins. Where's the goblin? The goblin is invisible. <laughs> Where's the goblin? It looks like I'm attacking the border guard. Oh my gosh. Okay, well... So long as the border guard won't attack me in turn, that's fine, I guess. Lamau, shrimp is love. Shrimp is life. <laughs> I, who, I didn't even know I had to be fighting goblins with invisibility potions, my goodness. Alright, there we go. Heal up, Sergey. Consume the shrimp. Take beer. <laughs> beer. Okay, somehow this goblin was carrying beer on its body. Okay, sure. Let's 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 just accept that, okay? Hey goblin. 
It just... Eh. Eh. <laughs> yes. Yes. Indy says, Beer makes goblins invisible. The lore. The lore, everybody. Beer makes goblins invisible. That is the truth of the matter. Nice. Hey. Maybe we can just fight a couple more goblins until we reach two hours. Let's do that. We have, we still have a couple more shrimp. And we got a beer, so at least that's something. <laughs> um, it's very nice that they're choosing to always fight one-on-one. -on -one. Always. They understand the rules of combat. <laughs> Jat says, all right, I'm gonna go grab some wine and mix some soda real quick for my midnight art grinding. I'm trying to finish the line art before I sleep. Okay, go ahead, Jack. Enjoy. We only have beer here in the game, so enjoy your wine. <laughs> my wine and only Novellino. Nothing, nothing like good old boxed wine. Yes. Wine and only Novellino. Yes. If there's nothing else, at least it's a lot cheaper to get to get a box box wine. Indy says, "I have a confession for chat. I'm French and I dislike wine." Indy. Indy. What have you done? Dang it, Indy. Why 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 are you like this? <laughs> Wow, okay. Okay, th then again, you know, I'm I'm Filipino and I don't like certain, you know, dishes as well, so... You know, we can't always like everything that's considered part of our culture, so... It do be like that sometimes. I'm sorry. Oh, well, I'm I'm not I'm not your priest, <laughs> Indy. I, I I don't have a problem with it. It's it's <laughs> people. It's people nearby. Uh, imagine imagine, um, Indy. You wake up one morning and then you decide to just shout it with all of your chest. I don't like wine. I I believe that that would be a very big problem for everyone in your name for you and everyone in your neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> My goodness. Okay, attack the goblin, Sergey. Attack the goblin. Yes. 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 Okay, what happens if I do defense XP? I'll just sit here and let them attack me. I'm just gonna use my shield. <laughs> Indy says, imagine the worst, being Italian and disliking pizza. Oh no. Oh no. That's gonna be really, really difficult. My gosh. <clears throat> my defense is XP 8. Wow, okay. Defense XP would take long. Yeah, let's go ahead and just start killing this goblin. Okay. It doesn't, it doesn't deserve me to wait, so we'll just go ahead and cut it down. Dang, okay. More bow. Goblin mail. Interesting. Okay, let's go ahead and see if we can wear this thing. Wear goblin mail. This armor is too small for a human. <laughs> okay, well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I'm not, if I can't fit me. My goodness. Attack the goblin. Yes. Hey, what's up? S smack, smack, smack. Attack, attack. <gasps> Sergey, Sergey, inventory, inventory. Eat the shrimp, eat the shrimp. Okay, there we go. Okay, round two, baby. <laughs> okay, now it's time. Let's go, let's go. Come on. Indy says, they're challenging you, you have to wear it. You are the symbol of fashion. <laughs> Just go ahead and take take the take the armor that belongs to you now, Sergey. Yes.
Okay, so let's see here. Uh, that's a lot of art raffles on Twitter right now. <laughs> Always got to make sure you join them. Okay, so let's see. All right. Anyway, let's go ahead and I think this is going to be good enough for now. Let me just drink my beer. It only gave me one health point. You feel slightly reinvigorated and slightly dizzy too. What? And eat one more shrimp. There we go. I think that's good enough. Okay, so I think we're going to be calling it off right here. We're just going to go ahead and um, do even more on a future stream. So let's go ahead and wrap it up today. And thank you once again, everybody, for stopping by to this stream. I greatly appreciate you taking the time to join me once again in another Gorilla stream. I really hope that this stream was able to bring you a little more color to your day. And also, I would just like to comment. Indy says, what would happen if you drink a lot of beers when you're probably going to be feeling very, very drunk and not happy? <laughs> But yeah, th there's so many thing more things to discover in this game, and hopefully we'll be able to experience them more together. But again, thank you to everybody for all of your help in getting me to 780 followers here on Twitch. We have a few more days left, maybe we can make it to seven, uh, 800? Who knows? But for now, I would like to acknowledge um, Sinvil Dev for the follow, Chili Beans for the follow, and Watage Yua for the follow, and Thunder Raiden 56 for the raid. Thank you very much once again, everybody, for choosing me uh, to share your communities and for choosing to follow me. Now, I want to share the love as well, so we do have a redeem. Kindly let me know who do you want me to raid for today, please. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, so let's see. Random? Okay, I do have an idea. I have someone that I haven't raided in quite a while. So we're gonna be raiding my good friend, The Rolling Thunder One, who is one of my inspirations to actually start streaming in the first place. And Rolling Thunder is currently playing, uh, uh, what's this? Monster Hunter Rise, and they are doing a surprise Donathon. So let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and show them some Serjavian Nation love. Here is their channel, and here is the raid message as well. So thank you once again, everybody, for your time. Once again, I hope this stream brought a little more color to your day. My name is Sergey and Serena saying, you take care, always stay safe, and keep the world turning. Bye now, salam aspect, love y'all.